We are here in our in our first semifinals uh, with the Transylvania Pioneers. Um, we've got Zach Laramore as well as uh, Coach Coach Brian Lane. Uh, first of all, I'll just start, uh, Coach. If you can kind of summarize the game from your perspective, and then Zach, I'll ask you to do the same. I thought Hanover did a tremendous job today uh, in, in making some adjustments from from our game last week. Um, we had we came up last last week with a pretty good game plan and. And we were able to get get out of here with a victory, which um, we knew was was a pretty good win. Uh, they made some adjustments, and, and John did a nice job of, of neutralizing uh, the inside uh, presence that, that really was the key in our victory last week. Um, you know, the I thought in the first half we had a couple different chances there uh, when. We got down eight or nine, and cut it back to three a couple different times, and then couldn't get those key stops that, that we needed to do to kind of get over the hump. But um, I was really proud of the way our guys continue to, to fight and, and um, try to try to get back into it. Second half, we had to had to start pressing, and then when that happens, uh, I guess a really good basketball team with with good guards is, it makes it very tough. So. Um, from that standpoint, um, proud of my guys' effort and how tough they play. Zach, do you want to give yeah. a quick summary? Um, I mean, Coach Lane said it. Um, you know, you got to give Hanover credit. It's a good team over there. Um, and for us, you know, we fought. Um, we fought all year. And uh, it's a tough way to go out, but we have a lot more on so. Yeah. Um, looking looking ahead, uh, Coach, I'm noticing you know Zach here had a had a nice game, put up a lot of points, but uh, four or three of your top four scorers are, are freshmen and sophomores, so um, fairly young team. Um, and uh, what do you see uh, down the road here um, coming off of this season? Well, this, this team, I just talked to them one about our senior class and how. We were trying to get them into the conference championship game for the fourth straight year, which was an incredible number. Uh, came up one game short of, of doing that, but uh, to be able to, to do that three out of four years at, while, while they're in college is something that's special. Um, now, with that being said, early on, Grandpa here, it was like he was, <laughs> he was the, the mama duck and the little duck, ducklings were running across and he was having to make sure they didn't get hit by the cars because he had to teach a lot of young guys a lot of am I right? And and, <laughs> and but so we ended up evolving as the, as the season got better um, as the season went and we got better and better to get and got to the point where basically after our trip to Las Vegas after the holidays we kind of tweaked some things and then won eight of eight of the last nine to get to this to this point. So uh, the future's bright. Um, I told them in there that what these guys have done as seniors is, is hopefully going to allow us to, to upgrade our schedule a little bit. Uh, we're, we play a national schedule, but we're wanting to, to kind of get back to where we were a few years ago where we were um, really having a, a good SOS that, that could compete nationally. And I think when you have freshmen and sophomores that are playing the significant minutes that, that we have, that that's something that you can look at as a coach and and do, but they will have to make the, the same strides that these guys made uh, over the years. That they, we can't say you are all going to be good, and then they not do do what they need to do in the off season, especially in the weight room, uh, and then and then uh, just expect it to happen. I don't believe this group will do that, just from the, the character that, that Larry here and, and some of the other seniors have been able to to help instill. And Zach, uh, coach mentioned it there. Um, you know, all, all of my conference championships, you you played in them. And uh, uh, tell us just as you reflect. And obviously, um, you'll you'll take some days. And, and this this uh, loss is fresh. But um, you've had a really special career. Tell us about uh, you know what it means to you um, to to finish up at Transy and, and kind of how you feel. Uh, I guess it really hasn't set in yet. But, uh, <laughs> You know, I appreciate Coach Lyon for the taking a chance on me to let me come and play at uh, Transy. And um, I got here and it was, you know, it was kind of expected that, you know, we 
make a run at a conference uh, tournament and ultimately make it to the NCAA tournament every year. And um, so that's kind of the culture that I came into, and it was just my goal to, um, you know, keep that culture alive. And uh, hopefully I've done a well enough job to pass it down to the younger guys. There's a lot of talent in our locker room. And, uh, you know, they have a chance to do some really special things if they, if they do what they're supposed to do, which I think they will. Perfect.